hey guys hey y'all so i'm coming back with like a quick video to tell you what is happening today to me usually people don't really display this type of information but today i'm getting tested for the coronavirus um it's not that i'm showing any symptoms or anything like that it is just a basic requirement of the state now that i live in that all facilities get tested for the coronavirus and so um about two weeks ago i was supposed to get tested like two weeks ago they gave me a big packet to make me sign all these forms to basically give the company that i work for consent for my results and so out of like genuine genuine curiosity i asked i said okay what would happen if somebody refuses the test and they was like, okay you will not be able to work in this state of this 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 if you were to refuse and i was like, okay well that was just out of genuine curiosity i signed my freedom papers because <laughs> that's that's basically what it is the freedom papers honestly and you know um i understand like people can have it if they're asymptomatic and everything like that but i'm not showing any symptoms or anything like that my health has been pretty intact and honestly as a nurse um whether you like it or not you've probably been in contact with it in some form or fashion um so that's just what it is you're around patients that are sick all the time you've probably been in contact with something just worse honestly so uh, i'm not too worried about it or anything like that uh, so i signed my papers and um they were supposed to test us a couple of weeks back they saw and then they ran out of kits they ran out of kits right <laughs> and so they was like okay well we we can't give y'all the test and so i was like okay so are y'all doing oral like swapping the mouth or are you doing nasal and they was like okay first we're we gonna do sputum we're gonna do sputum i'm like okay that's that's good because i don't want nobody really picking through my nose like oh my goodness i feel like that is just the most invasive thing in the world and I honestly might just cry. I might just cry. <clears throat> and so um, we'll see when I get there what type of method they're going to do. They said they, it's going to happen today. They're going to test the resident. And then they're going to test the faculty. And um, we all have to be there. So we basically in this group text. And they was like, okay, be here at 830. And then they were like, never mind. We're uh, we going to first test the residents. And then uh, y'all try to get here at 9.30. I mean, they keep just changing the times on us. And I'm like, man, dude, let's just get this over with. Let's do this so I can go home because this is my off day, honey. This is my off day. Come on now. <coughs> this braid out is terrible. It's terrible. Whoa, just <laughs> okay. Okay, you're done. Oh, my goodness. Okay. Right? Yeah. Just see me just get out of testing <sighs> for the corona um I'm literally like shaking because like when I seen her I don't know she had like a tube and it was like serum at the bottom and she told me that it was going to burn 
and when she put it up there for 10 seconds it burned and I felt really different like <laughs> really different I've never I've never had some shit like this done I'm sorry excuse my last some stuff like this <laughs> done before like ever you know that it felt really different it was like she was picking my brain like I felt like she was trying to take something you know <laughs> like what are you doing ma'am like I hurried up and clocked out and, and walked out like I had to just stop at a gas station just to talk to y'all and get a breather because being in this for 12 hours coming to work like this for 12 hours makes it extremely hear me out extremely difficult to breathe I am breathing my own carbon dioxide. So of course I'm gonna feel dizzy. I'm not gonna feel like myself after 12 hours. That's I think that's uh, the misconception that a lot of people have when it comes to masks. This mask is not 100% guaranteed to save you from the corona. I'ma just tell you that right now, it's not 100%. Maybe an N95 mask, but you do not see that with every person. It lowers the risk, it lowers the risk. <laughs> But being in this for 12 hours, it, it's, it's rough. It is very, very rough. So when I was in there, our DM Wynn was saying that they're only just testing the long-term care facilities. And I said, they're not testing the assisted living, the rest of the staff, like housekeeping or anything like that. They was like, no, uh, they only testing long-term care because it's reg regulated by Medicare. And I said, well, that, that basically just defeats the purpose, don't it? Don't it just defeat the purpose if you don't test the whole entire staff? So you got sister living walking in the same door as we would possibly could get the uh, coronavirus. And you walk around people who got tested for the corona and whether we come back negative or positive and stuff like that. That kind of just like defeats the purpose because and then also like they were saying that um, we won't get our test results back until in another 14 days. I'm like, I thought these test results were stat. They was like, no. And we were all just thinking the same thing. Like, this is low-key bogus. Like, it's, it's, it defeats the purpose if you don't have stat results. You're not testing the whole staff. You know, they pushed our test back days at a time, you know. But, <laughs> girl, that, that was just, the, it was a different experience. Different, different experience. Like, you know, I, I'm confident, you know, uh, that I'm good, I'm negative and stuff like that. I'll, I'll let y'all know what it is. You know, if that's the case, then, you know, you self-quarantine, you do what you're supposed to do. But, you know, I'm pretty, I keep my health pretty intact. And I know what to do, what not to do. Um, so I'm just going to go home for now and get my life, <laughs> my life together because that was, that was very different. See, I got my my juice and berries. You see this LPN cup? My name on there. My juice and berries. Got the juice. Take my herbs. Baby, I'm about to lay my down. <laughs> but I just wanted to show y'all how that test goes. That was. I just wanted. I just wanted to show y'all. <laughs> y'all, y'all have a great day, and I will keep you posted. I will. Okay. Yeah, have a nice day.